My name is Chris Richter, and I'm the Technical Support Manager at R&D Technologies. Today, I'd like to talk about why your Stratasys Object Desktop Printer doesn't start when you would expect it to, and when you look at your printer control software, it indicates it's reinitiating. If your printer has been idle for 48 hours or longer, the printer will automatically reinitiate the next time you start a print job. This will clear out stale resin from the model print head, the print block, and some of the resin tubing. Over time, the resin tends to thicken inside of these components, so when it comes time to print, we don't get the proper amount of resin leaving the model head. The end result might look like a melted appearance on the top surface of the model, or if you look at the side walls of the model, they may appear wavy or uneven. When a print is started by the operator, the print heads and the print block are automatically heated. This can take 5 to 10 minutes. It depends on the temperature of the room that the printer is located in. The heads will then be purged and wiped. That will add another 2 minutes to the startup time. When that completes, you would normally see the UV light turn on and then printing would begin. But if the printer had been idle for more than 48 hours, the heads will move back over the purge area and the model head will be fired into the purge area. By fired, I mean it's electrically pulsed, as if it were printing. This will take 6 to 12 minutes, depending on how long the printer was idle beyond the 48-hour threshold. The heads will then be purged and wiped again. That will add another 2 minutes. And finally, the UV light will turn on, and printing passes across the build tray will begin. It can actually take up to 25 minutes for some prints to start. While the model head is being fired into the purge area, there won't be any noise coming from the printer other than from the exhaust fan. The parameters that control when reinitiate runs and for how long are hidden in the printer control software and are not intended to be changed. When the print job finishes, the printer automatically starts counting how many hours has elapsed from the last job. In this example, we have 53 hours. The printer then checks to see if more than 48 hours has passed before starting the next job. That parameter is defined right here. In this example, 53 hours has passed, so the printer is going to be told to reinitiate. The number of times the model head will fire into the purge area is defined here. This will take about 6 minutes. It takes about 1 pulse per second. In the event the printer had been idle for more than 96 hours, 360 pulses is not quite enough to get rid of resin from some of the resin tubing in the printer. So the parameter defined here, 96 hours, is so that we can reinitiate longer. So we're going to tell the printer to reinitiate or fire the model head for 720 pulses. That can take about 12 minutes. Hopefully this helps clear up any confusion about what's happening while your printer is reinitiating. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. And if there's any other content you would like to see us present, feel free to let us know. Thank you.